I'm going to show you how to remotely turn on your computer using LogMeIn. Okay, the first step to turning on your computer remotely would be to, of course, make a LogMeIn account. You can go to LogMeIn.com, download the software to your computer, install it, and you can remotely control your computer if you haven't done so already. To be able to enable Wake on LAN, which is what enables the ability to turn on your computer remotely, you have to have well, first a compatible motherboard. Most newer motherboards will have this feature built in. The older ones, like my Dell back here, which is uh, I think over four years old now, does not have it built in. But my good desktop over here does, so I can anywhere I am when that's connected to the internet it's possible for me to turn it on and then start remote controlling it now I'm gonna show you that now okay so you can't see my mouse on the right as you saw before that switch on computer I'm gonna press it now you see my computer just turned on if you look over here turn it on I'm going to skip ahead for you. Okay, now that I'm in the BIOS, for my BIOS, which is the P5Q Pro Turbo motherboard from ASUS, you would go to the power options, you go down the APM configuration, I'm not sure what APM stands for, but then you have these settings, and I just enable it for external modem and those devices. You, s you would just enable that and save and as you can see until the computer's fully turned on it's still saying switching on for the log in so you click save we'll boot back up and when windows is booted i'm going to show you how to enable it because i had to enable a setting in the network uh, driver to let me use wake on land as you can see my computer is now booted up if you look right here you can see the remote control now. I'm gonna show you through log me in the requirements. Log in. I still have the pro trial on this computer because I just reinstalled it. It's connecting. Now it changed over here. You see the mouse move. You can see the two computers. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, so okay, so you gotta log me in right here. What you do is you will go into actually I'm just gonna show it over here. You go to network and uh, you go into control panel this is for Windows 7 which it sh should work the same anyway if you're on XP Vista Windows 7 you just have to go find device manager whatever system you're on and then you will go to your network adapters mine's that one your properties you'll go to advanced You gotta wake up capabilities. Make sure it's on that magic pack and pattern match. Uh, and mix up stuff like that. And shut down and wake ups enable. That should be all you have to do to enable wake on land on your computer. And uh, I've found this multiple times to be useful. I've had to turn my computer on remotely so I could get a file, which is really helpful. And if you wanted to, you could install it on your computer and leave it there at your house and then pull a prank on somebody by turning it on right in front of them and like making the computer play music or something. It'd be funny. But 
that's how you turn on your computer remotely using LogMeIn for Wake on LAN. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe.